dangling 200 feet in the air at almost 178,000 pounds is the Endeavour, which will soon be the only fully stacked space shuttle in the entire world. She will be lifted straight up over the wall and then seated between the two solid rocket motors and the external tank. It's the first time this maneuver has been done outside of a NASA facility. It's also the same full stack arrangement that helped launch the Endeavour into 25 space voyages over its 19 year career. It's only three in the entire world left. Just to see the space shuttle hanging there, it's once in a lifetime opportunity. It's amazing that it left our planet and came back, uh, now it's here in California. This is the end, the flight's over. And here's how it all connects. There's actually three attachment points. There's the forward attach point by the nose, and then there are two attachment points uh, down there near the tail. So they'll bring those in for a soft dock where they'll latch on. That part took about nine and a half hours. <laughs> and then there's the hard dock. Hard dock is when we basically drive the bolts home and, and secure it. I don't think they can speed it up just a little bit. <laughs> No, definitely not. Once placed, the Samuel Ocean Air and Space Center will be constructed around the orbiter. We've got about a year and a half to go in the construction process, and then after that, we have to install all of the hands-on exhibits and the artifacts, so still a few years before it opens to the public. Hopefully a lot of kids are going to come here, and, and, and adults too, and look up at this thing, at this amazing piece of machinery that we created, go away thinking that, yeah, you know, whatever they want to do is a possibility. Not, it's not an impossibility.